Hello everyone, how are you? And you are watching an expert, and I'm here with you with another quick tutorial. And I have installed Oracle VM VirtualBox. And whenever I try to install any guest operating system in a VirtualBox, and I just post your Windows 10 machine in a VirtualBox, and also I want to change the allocation of processor and the memory. And whenever I click to system and processor, the you can see that the option is gray. I can't change the processor allocation and the memory display. And in the bottom side, you can see that the error uh, is pop up system acceleration page. The hardware visualization is enabled in acceleration section. Invalid setting detection error. Invalid setting detection error. It should be disabled in order to start the virtual system. First of all, we have to find that either the virtualization is enabled or not. To ensure that the virtualization is enabled or not, you just right click the task bar and go to the task manager. In the performance tab, you can see that the virtualization is disabled. You can also find that the virtualization is enabled or not into a CMD. Just type CMD. And here you have to type system info or fetching some information that will be displayed. Some report type. Hyper requirement monitor more extension yes and virtualization enable is from where no so we have confirmed that the virtualization is not enabled in our BIOS so we have to go into BIOS and the and we have to enable the virtualizations properties in the BIOS menu so restart the PC so we restart the PC and go into the BIOS menu F10 keys to go to the BIOS mode granting the setup is the F10 key go to the security tab and system security in the second option you can see that the virtualization technology vtx is disabled and changed we have, we have to change in the in key and the os manager of embedded security device also need to enable an f10 to accept save changes and exit are you sure you want to save changes and exit? Yes. So now we are backed up, and after the start, after enable the virtualization option in the BIOS menu. So now we will see that the come the still error is pop up or not. And whenever I click to setting, and uh, you can see that the error is not pop up, and our problem has been resolved. I hope this video will be informative for you, and you will enjoy it. If you have not subscribed my channel, please do consider subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon and also like the videos. Thanks for watching.